Well, I'll end up on the coast. Hey, I'm Sararin. Well, this is me regearing myself again. I was killed by a hacker, of course, when I was, um, sitting in a bush making a sandwich, and I come back to about 26,000 astral charges next to me. So I'm off to make my way back to the coast. I back to where I died, I guess. I switched servers and everything. I just I quit playing the game for a few days too. This is why I haven't had a video out in a few days. It's just kind of depressing, you know. You work all this way just to have some little script kitty blow it up and then hide your body. Out of all the games to hack, I just I don't understand it on this game. You don't get to hear their, you know, their reaction. You just, inside you know they're mad, but it doesn't affect me really anymore. I, I used to all the time, you know, I'd go, oh my god, hackers, and oh, this game sucks, but now it's just like, you know what, part of the game. Just gotta work on regearing yourself and uh, getting yourself back out there. Hopefully my frame rate will stay at a good good day today and I'll be able to actually record. I won't have to ditch this footage because I can't even uh, play but I figured I might as well muck around and turn off for a bit maybe meet some people or make some new friends but I doubt I'll make any friends. I'll more meet bullets to my face and another chance at respawning. I'm gonna hit the hospital here before I go to uh, the pub and the uh, general store on the other side. Maybe the military tents will have some goodies for me, but mm, I don't know. I'm, <laughs> I'm at the point where this game is just its novelty is starting to wear off, I guess. It's starting to get not as fun to play alone. You want to just meet people instead of shooting them, but nobody wants to say hi. And it doesn't matter your gear, they're, if you're a fresh spawn, they'll kill you too. And it's gotten to that point in the game. So, uh, I heard Daisy Standalone's coming out uh, December, I believe. That's what they announced it. I'm kind of excited for it. You know, a new chance at uh, this game gives a new life. Uh, door fail. Hopefully, uh, Rocket will lock down the servers so nobody has to uh, deal with script kitties anymore. The new map looks amazing, though. I've only seen screenshots and, uh, you know, what people thought about it, but <sighs> I'm excited. Um, I just, I hope, I hope, you know, people who bought it to play the mod now get a little bit of a uh, kind of, I don't even know. I have two. Okay. Three, four. I'm playing on a private server right now. I I have some other things in my buddy's account. I just really don't feel like kind of t using it. That should be good. I'm gonna check you. Maybe have antibiotics. Nope. Okay. Now I saw some barbed wire uh, over here. Hopefully it's not blocking what I think it's blocking, because if it is, I'm going to be sad. So that means there's going to be no loot. <sighs> yeah, of course, nothing. Oh, there's a can of soda. I <laughs> it's better than nothing. Mm, useless. I'll throw that one. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, really? Of <sighs> all the places to put barbed wire. All the places. <sighs> Let's go to the fire station. 
No, I really enjoy Chono this time. It's kind of peaceful in a way. In a weird, creepy kind of way, you know? I don't see anybody up in the sniper position, so... I doubt I'm going to have to worry about that. I don't know, I... This town always feels weird to me when it's this quiet. It's like, where is everybody, you know? I really stuck at this door. Screw it. What do you yeah, I, I should check the Ponal X. No. Mm, I'll do it later. I hope you guys find this enjoying at least. I just <laughs> really not in the mood to talk. I I guess I could give you an update a little bit on my life. Uh, I, I joined the football team. Um, I'm now the starting defensive end for the, my uh, high school. That's... I'm actually kind of excited for it. You know, I've, I've never joined a team. I've always kind of been that little quiet kid in the back that goes, you know what, nah, I'll let somebody else do it. You know, it's too time-taking, and I stick to my own little world. But, you know what, joining the team has actually gave me... A, mm, joining the team has actually gave me, like, a great opportunity to meet people. Like, I've became more friends with the team, you know, the senior team. It's doing, uh, or kind of friends, like it's, I could say. <laughs> That's all the buddy system for football teams, but, um, yeah, I've, I've had, you know, a game ready. I've had a practice, too. The practice is actually really fun. Um, they're not as boring as what I figured, you know, I pictured a lot more just kind of slow pace, but they're, they're, they shake you up. Um, what else? <laughs> I'm trying to think as I loot. Can't do two things at once anymore. Um, but yeah, it's, I, if anyone who hasn't, you know, has that same thought as I did, you know, like, it's, it, it's always up to somebody else, you know, I, if, if you're a little bit shy, just talk to one of the coaches and, you know, you don't even have to join it first, but say, you know, can I show up to one of the practices or even show up to one of the games and just watch it and kind of base your decision off of that. Like, I had a friend who got me into it. He, you know, he he talked me into talking to the coach about it, and, you know, I went to a practice or two and kind of did the little routine they had, and... Sooner or later, here I am, fully ready, and now a starter position. <laughs> it it changes your life in a way. Um, you you get you get so caught up in your your self activities that you don't realize how much fun interacting with people is. How much fun, you know, when someone asks you to hang out and you you have something to do. It's like wow, I'm busy now, you know, I, not, <laughs> it's almost hard to get used to, in a way. And I, I honestly have to thank my friend for that, he's the best, and he knows who he is, um, who got me into it. W without him uh, talking to me, I'd probably still be, you know, that quiet person sitting in the back of the room that doesn't say much, or I'd be that person everyone looks at and goes who is he because he doesn't talk and he make he makes his own way with his own friends and doesn't speak out against any other people um that's kind of who I used to be but I've, I've changed a lot now I'm I'm more opinionative um, I have to kill that zombie behind me I'm I'm more open to things Shots, Makarov. 
I knew I heard somebody, probably at the church. I'll go say hi. Hopefully he's friendly. Hello, you there? Hello? Okay, not there. Let me keep my eye open though, I don't know exactly where he was. I wish you would shoot again though. I, I don't know, should I try to be friendly to this guy? You think he's gonna be all gung-ho about meeting a new player, or is he gonna freak out and shoot me? <sighs> Things to worry about. <laughs> I'll try to be friendly. Maybe make a friend. This is just part of the game I hate though, is when you know somebody's around and you're just playing the hello game every time you walk into a building. Oh shit, that was close. Oh, he's at the fire station. Oh, I'm, gonna go. I'm gonna make a friend. Definitely fire station. Hello, are you there? Hey, I'm friendly. Um, you wanna group up? Alright, cool, I'm gonna come in. Alright, I'm inside. What's up, dude? Come down, it's safe. Oh cool, I made a friend. Hopefully he's gonna be nice as me. I gotta shoot a zombie, so don't freak out. Oh my aim is so bad. I think we should be getting out of here before we attract more. Uh, you want to meet up at the Father's Hospital, the Penelac building? Alright, I'll just follow you. That's awesome, I have a friend. Didn't shoot me for once, holy crap. He's <laughs> uh, got a lead though, so he can take me out easy. I'll just be friendly with him. I wonder if he's gonna take me, or he's gonna take me to his friend and shoot me in the face. Oh well, but I made a friend now. I um, guess there is kind of a nice side to this game, after all. Not just those people who go, oh my god, player kill! You know, it's it's fun to kind of have this side of the game where you meet up with people and survive. That's that's why this game was invented, you know? It's a survival game, not just a, oh, you have good loot, I'm gonna just pop you in the head. Like, I could have killed him. He had no idea I was there. But I decided to take the risk and say, hey, hello, how are you? And I got my best buddy. Doesn't seem to have a backpack though, so I'm a little bit worrisome of that. But it's not not gonna let it bug me. What's his name again? Alpha Bravo? Oh I forget. Whatever. Really surprised you didn't shoot me, man. I'm so used to seeing bandits. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I just got killed by a hacker, so I said, ah, what the hell, why not try to meet some people? You new to the game? Uh, okay. Yeah, it's private servers are buggy sometimes like that. Hmm. Experienced player. Surprised you didn't just shoot me. Aw, oh, damn, that sucks. Did you have anything before? Oh shit, that's terrible, man. I feel like I got hacked when he logged out or something, and yeah, it happens. Poor buddy just lost an AS50, though. I feel for him. I've lost so many of those myself. Where'd it go? Oh, there he is. Nah, it's empty. I'm gonna go check the other ones. This guy's nice. Didn't shoot me in. <laughs> See? There's nice people in this world. <laughs> Not everyone wants to shoot you in the face. Just some of them. Yeah, there's other loot in the other ones. I think that one's just bad. I'm sure he'll figure it himself. Yeah, I, I really love how this game has uh, in-game voice com. It's, it's it's nice, you know, talking to people without being on Skype or Steam or whatever voice channel you you know you use. It's kind of relaxing, you know, to know that someone is there and they can speak to you. Or I'm just weird. One of the two. <laughs> A lot of empty tin cans, though. I might use that to uh, break the hospital. I bet he doesn't have a backpack, though. I feel for him. It sucks without a backpack, because you lose that, you know, those six to eight slots, I believe, that you can use to book here in. Uh, cool, cool. I, uh, I found a Lee Enfield mag for you if you want it. Alrighty. There you go. <sighs> See, the only thing I don't like about this is those if we get too far apart, we can't talk to each other. But that's life, you know? Really think about it in real life if you get too far apart it's uh, there's nothing in here though I don't even have a main gun <laughs> feel so weak uh, some more food though so won't go without I'll take some of that too just in case I do find a Winchester oh I pray for one This is another big thing, though, uh, around me is, you know, as ironic as it sounds, I'm, I, I'm not a Christian, but even though I say, you know, I pray or whatever, it's, <laughs> I don't know why, I'm just gonna shut up, um, so where is he now? Huh, I lost him. Whatever, my poor friend. I'm sure he knows where I am. Seems to be a lot. Oh, another little mag for him. I'll take that. Uh, some more food. Ah, crap. Alright, well. Needs to be going to my main inventory. 
put that there. It'll be nice enough to give me a gun. Ooh, they hate me today. Just a lot of food. Which I guess is a blessing and a curse. <laughs> um, you never get have too much food, but at the same time, what are you gonna do? Kill your kill your enemies with diabetes? Oh no, I think I've lost my friend. Lost my friend. Oh no, I'm quite sad. Well, well, that concludes this part. Um, damn, I kind of wanted to hang out with him for a little bit. Whatever. Well, dude, if you ever see this, I forget your name already because I'm not that intelligent. You're a cool guy. Didn't shoot me. You know, I gave you a mag, and now yeah, I guess we part ways. So well. Um, I'm probably gonna go to sleep. That was a little bit of fun. I shall see you guys. Oh, fuck it. I'm not gonna leave yet. I'm getting this building. <laughs> Let's log out Slipper Hill. Do, 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 do. Fucking my, my brain. I haven't had much sleep. I'm kind of weary. i try to play this game a little bit more. Maybe find a uh, another friend. But for now, I will log out in this building, and I will see you guys later.